Hey right guys, Trip Punch Joe here. Let's try that again. Hey right guys, Trip Punch Joe here, and today we are watching and reacting to episode 13 of Friends Season 5. Last episode, Ross was off the rails. As is anyone surprised? What was the last episode called actually? I didn't check. Uh, the one with Chandler's work life. I mean, yeah, that makes sense. Now reminds me of how good that story was actually was with uh, Monica and Chandler. So yeah, Rachel trying to weasel her way around Joey, talking about Monica and and Chandler and her just, you know, letting them think that she doesn't know a thing even though it's very clear that she does, but no. I uh, I, re I liked Rachel last episode, I think it was probably her best episode of the season which is saying a lot because I still don't think, you know, she was incredible in in the last episode but uh, she she was good, I like that she just let Monica, you know, think, think what she think what she thinks uh, so yeah, episode 13 though guys, if you enjoy, remember to leave a like if you're new, remember to subscribe and if you do want the early and uncle reactions to friends then link to the Patreon page will be in the description and one of the comments down below where there should be around 10 episodes ahead so let me check, how many, there's 24 in this season, not 23 or 22 so they'll be on the penultimate episode of season 5 which I've heard is a two-parter anyway so they'll basically be on the finale of season five by the time this one is on YouTube. So that'll be down below if you want to join us over on there alongside my Twitter and Instagram. But for now, let's do this. Can't believe we've never done this before. Hey, so Mr. Good. Masseuse. So good Masseuse Bing. Oh, look at that. Time's up. My turn. <laughs> Fair enough. It's your timer. You know, I don't like this is the one where Monica but can't massage the anyone. Best. Ah, ah. <laughs> <laughs> so good, isn't it? Say goodbye to Yo, he's family. actually having to like. <laughs> he's having to bite down on his pillow. Oh, new intro, let's go! Makes sense of the plan. I'll let it slide. Bit slow mo there. We've got some Chandler and Monica in there doing more slow mo. Oh, good little lens shot there. They went, they went hard with the, the slow motion in that one, but. That was a good intro. I mean, you can't go wrong. You've got the song just throwing clips of the characters. <laughs> As long as the clap goes in sync, that's the important part. Okay, I'm not gonna screw that up by, you know, telling the truth. <laughs> Fair enough. Oh, dude, look, who's the <laughs> why, Joey, why? There's no, no. <laughs> that's a fair this reaction. This be the place where you explain the hat. You find something as sophisticated as this. <laughs> Done. <laughs> yeah, fair enough. It looks better. Look good, why don't you just come down to the store? I'll help you out. Great, thanks, Rach. Sure. Yeah, let's get a Rach and Joey scene. But uh, my grandma sort of died. <gasps> right. Oh, sure. What? Did, was there some laughs in there? She had a really I mean, I'm laughing. But yeah. <laughs> I just saw two people having sex in a car right outside. <laughs> Chandler's face is like the timing. Because it's like, <clears throat> you know, one life ends and another begins. Yeah. Not the way they're doing it. <laughs> right, that's... <laughs> what, what she had to, she had to slip that in, she could have just let her have it. Okay. Oh, I know. Look at okay. An actual jacket, maybe? A bag. See, look, men. Look at that catalogue, wow. Carrying the bag. See, look, women carrying the bag. <laughs> He's buzzing. Exactly, unisex. Maybe you need sex. I had sex a couple of days ago. <laughs> That's such a basic joke. I love that. I've never heard that ever. You need sex. They've done this twice. And Joey and Rachel are going to hook up. They've hinted at it twice now. God. It's Phoebe. Oh, great. Oh, you. Oh, yeah. This. I forget um, this. Well, um, Let's look for discrepancies. Died today. Wow. Okay, enjoy your concert. Thanks, enjoy your funeral. Didn't these two will ever have like a bonding moment? There's five seasons left, so possibly. <laughs> oh, it looks good. Just like your son, Mrs. Tribbiani. Are you referring to my man's bag? <laughs> yes, Joey. First, I thought it just looked good, but it's practical too. Check it out. I it's love it. Your makeup. <laughs> nah, we're, Joey, we're vibing with ripping into tomorrow. Joey. Why would I ever turn this? I love this bag. <laughs> How much does it cost then? You owe me three hundred fifty dollars. Three fifty. What's the part, Auntie Mame? <laughs> nah, Joey looks cool. Yes, Rachel, okay. hype him up. It's three times. Well, okay, here's your M3D glasses. 
Um, <laughs> <laughs> God, that's what they used to look like, Jesus. I was alive when 3D glasses looked like that. The crappy paper that you just put. Ugh. Really? What's your name? Frank Buffet. Ooh. <laughs> Actually, it's, it's Joe. Uh, <laughs> no. Uh, Joe uh, Hill. BB storyline. No, Joe Hill. Oh, my what? God. There you go. What? What, honey? What happened? It was my dad. Oh, my God. Finally. Hey guys, check it out. Check it out. It's like it's coming right at me. <laughs> yeah, man. Finally, we get a Phoebe storyline. I mean, she's just had a really good one, to be fair. It's not like it. we've been dying for it. Could everyone please take their seats? Yes. No, I just can't obscure that voice from the rafters. I, to say goodbye to my grandma. <laughs> I can't be asked. What funeral is this? <laughs> Look at them all. No one said put them on as well, so you've already disobeyed the rules. I'm off to my audition. How do I look? Uh, I think you look great, Joey. That's yes, a Rachel. And a date with a man. <laughs> Team Rachel on this. All you want. All right. So from now on, you guys are gonna have to get used to the fact. That yes, Joey. Joey. Comes with a bag. Hi, little oh, Rachel's buzzing. I love that. Oh. I mean, this guy abandoned you. I gotta tell you, if it were me, this guy would be in some serious physical danger. I mean, what? I, I, I want out. <laughs> okay, that I scared myself. Yep, that's... <laughs> well, at least you scared someone. <laughs> Wrecked. It's funny. You... Oh, get up, Al! Oh, Why? Why are you doing that to me? What are you talking about? Phoebe would know as well, yeah. A human. <laughs> Uh, Never do that to anyone. It's given to Rachel all the time before she got allergic. Allergic to light. There you go. There's your answer. Then watch. Said he's in pain. No, he's not. Yes, he is. Oh. I'm sorry, but ah, ah, ah. You've been lying to me. Oh. I can't believe you do that. Well, maybe you just didn't want to hurt your feelings. But the minute we start to lie to each other. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, oh, oh. He... I mean society. <laughs> yeah, good save. <laughs> Come on, Ross. Could you try it without the purse? Oh, no. Yeah, sure. I'm sorry. Can I ask you something? Sure. What? Well, first, it's not a purse. <laughs> yes, Joey. I, I, let me show you the catalog. Right, okay. Look, look. Maybe not. Oh, no, 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 no. These babies sell themselves. <laughs> right. <laughs> okay. We got it. We got it. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. Jesus. I'm in that room from, I think, season one. <laughs> I, I just wish you could tell me. Just say it. I don't like your massages. Just say it. I don't like your massages. <laughs> oh. Ski? Oh, no! <laughs> Fuck. The best bad massage. And they were the thinking of themselves, best bad who's massage? the best at that? They'd have to go to you. I mean, it was, makes logical sense. Huh. <laughs> I suck. Yeah. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> I love them so much. They're class. <laughs> Sit. Yeah, just do what she says, mate. Alrighty. What did Francis leave me? Huh? Well, that's why you wanted, wanted me to come, right? Oh, yes. Yes. Yeah, no, she did. She left you. Um, I have just a few questions to ask, so I'm going to get out my official forms. Did you think this... Right. Yeah, you didn't think it through. Did we all... Um, did that marriage end A, happily, B, medium? Medium. C, in the total abandonment of her and her two children? Well, I guess then I, I, I would have to say C. Oh, wow. Okay. Being honest. Total abandonment. Uh -huh. Okay. Surely he knows. She's dead. Are you sure? Well, she isn't cremating her. It was a big mistake. <laughs> I can't believe this. I just I can't believe. How long ago? Seventeen years ago. Seventeen oh. years off, mate. What? What about the girls? Well, Ursula mate. is a waitress, and and she lives in Soho. And Phoebe. He's, she's gonna lie to him is on this couch. Oh, well, maybe not. Really, mate, you were that slow about it? 
Lipstick and a daughter. Big day for you. <laughs> <laughs> Can't believe that you're my daughter. You're so pretty. Yes, well, it's neither here nor there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake. Let's see, how did it, how did it go? Smarty Carl, so um, it's gonna be Smarty Carl. Yeah, okay. S uh, sleepy girl, sleepy girl. Oh, is that his version of it? There you go. The origin of Smarty Cat. I just, I, you know, I'm, I'm not very good at this, so. Um. Well, I am. Yes, Phoebe. Not yet, no. There you go. Finally. But they're waiting for a dad for five seasons. There he is. I think it's time to give up the bag. I don't want to give up the bag. He likes the bag. I have to give up the bag, do I, Mitch? You think I should give up the bag? <laughs> Wait, Joey, I'm sorry. I just don't know if the world is ready for you and your bag. <laughs> can't believe I'm hearing this. No, the world's ready you now, though, Joey. Bless him. I like Joey in the bag. <laughs> Sue him. All right, there we go, guys. That is episode 13 of Friends Season 5. Uh, pretty good episode, Andrew. I think it was maybe one of the more... Let me think. Yeah, I'd say it was one of the more weaker episodes of Season 5, but still really good. <laughs> so I'd say this is like one of the weaker episodes and we had Phoebe's dad finally come into it uh, after, like I say, five seasons of him not being there. But we're kind of getting like... You know, Phoebe's getting her family kind of fed to her season and season. Like, she gets one episode or two episodes a season where it's kind of to do with her and her family in the past, which is, you know, I think we could do more with... I've always said I think Phoebe could have more of a storyline, but I do think they've done a better job with her in season four and five, especially. Uh, so this is a really good episode for Phoebe's character and to, you know, finally have him be there and, you know, be as awkward as you'd imagine it would be <laughs> with Phoebe and her dad. Uh, I thought they did, that was the best part of the episode for sure. And then I'd say I really enjoyed Joey and the bag. Like, you know, Chandler and Ross's quippy jokes are kind of outdated now. I think, obviously, sure, when this aired in, what, 1999 or whatever. I'm sure those jokes were hilarious, but I just, it's just kind of like, oh, you've got a woman's bag. Uh, it's just kind of like, cool. <laughs> it kind of reminds me of when Ross was getting mad because his kid was playing with a Barbie instead of an action man. It's just kind of, you know, just a sign of the times in terms of the jokes aren't really... They're just out, outdated, I think. It's not really that funny. <laughs> but, uh, like, like now I'm like, yeah, Joey, fucking looks cool with the bag. Why not? I like, I love that part of the storyline. I love that Rachel was just kind of hyping him up for it until obviously the last, last moment there, but... She seemed proud of him, and you know, I, I love Joey. I think he's, he, as, as I've said before, I think this has been did, ah, this has been his best season in terms of jokes and you know likability. I think he's been really good. So, and then finally, Monica and Chandler and him telling her that she's not very good at massages. They're just adorable. I love him, and I love that she kind of he, he knew how to play it when he was like, you know, you'd get an award for the best worst mas massage or something. So. He knows how to work his way with Monica, so which is good to see. So, yeah, rating for this episode, I'm going to give it a 7.8, maybe like 7.7 .7 out of 10. I do think it was a really good episode. Not quite as great as some of the others, just mainly, like I said, because some of the jokes were a little bit outdated, and, uh, you know, I think the story the, the story with Joey and Monica and Chandler were very good, and then I'd say Phoebe was the one where it really... You know, the the actual storyline we had with this episode was Phoebe, and I think that was, that was good as well, so... Yeah, thanks for watching guys leave a like if you enjoyed i'm not used all the episode down below in the comments and if you do want the early and uncle reactions to friends then link to the patreon page will be in the description and one of the comments down below where they should be on the finale of season five by the time this one's on youtube and i shall see you next time for episode 14 until then take care peace